Hello all, uh, Vinod here from Endurance Engineering Academy. So uh, the students who had given their uh, gate 2021, okay. So the next step for them is going to be applying for PSUs and applying for MTechs in IIT, right? And also MTech in NIT and MSS depends on uh, MS depends on your uh, gate score. So those who are going to apply MTech in IIT and those who are going to apply for PSUs, okay, if, if there was any PSU which is recruiting through GATE, uh, then those PSUs and those MTech will uh, give their or will submit their offers through a single portal called as COPE, okay, Common Offer Acceptance Portal. Actually, I uh, I received a request regarding this. Okay, after uh, after after uh, what I could say, uh, after the video of uh, video regarding MS. Okay, so we made a video regarding MS, the detailed video on MS. After making that video, I got a request regarding making a video regarding COPE. Okay, so what is the procedure and all those things. In fact, all the procedures are clearly mentioned in their brochure itself. Okay, but anyways, I'm just going to give you some important points which you might miss okay when you are reading the brochure okay so first of all the first and foremost point which i wanted to highlight is cope is not an application portal okay so in cope that is common offer acceptance acceptance portal you cannot apply anything okay so individually for each and every iit and for psus you need to apply separately okay once after the notification started for example, if IIT Madras notification start, uh, sorry, for IIT Madras notification has given, and then they said that application date was starting by uh, April first week or April second week or whatever it is, you need to apply in IIT Madras portal separately. Okay, for the concern department, for example, you are applying for mechanical, or you are going to apply for uh, material science, okay, or else you are going to apply for aerospace or whatever. Okay, whatever department. You have to apply separately in each and every IIT individually. You need to apply to Metra separately, Hyderabad separately, Bombay separately, Delhi separately. For each and every IIT, you need to apply separately and then you need to give your preference of departments. Okay, this is must. You cannot expect uh, just by applying in COPE, okay, just by applying or just by registering in COPE, you will get an offer. Okay, that is not going to happen. You need to apply in each and every IIT. Then you have to register in COPE. These IITs will uh, give their offer through COPE. Okay. So COPE is just a medium. Okay. COPE is just a medium. So let me just say something like this. It's a medium. Uh, you are going to apply to IIT. Okay. You are going to apply to IIT for MTech. They will conduct a written test interview based on uh, different IITs. Okay, in few IITs they will conduct, in few IITs they won't. After conducting, they will submit their offer in COPE. Okay, then COPE will uh, sorry, then COPE will give offer to you. Okay, you need to accept this, uh, accept that, or you need to reject it. We will see the procedure in detail. Okay, but the basic idea is apply for IITs individually. Then IITs will post their offer in COPE. You need to accept the offer from COPE. Okay, so COPE is not a, a portal where you are going to apply. Okay, so let me just go through some important points which is which you might uh, miss. I, I already given you a very important point. Uh, that's that is something which you need to note. Okay, so yeah, all these things eligibility criteria gate. This time, as you know that uh, uh, every every time MTech uh, MTech will accept last three years uh, gate score. Okay, right. So regarding this there will be different rounds okay see what happened is you applied for suppose you applied for some five iits okay each and every iit uh, some iit there will be direct recruitment some iit they will conduct uh, they will conduct a written test and interview so they done everything individually okay they done everything individually and then iit madras iit karakpur iit kanpur iit bombay iit delhi let it be now you are getting seats in all this IIT. Okay. You are getting seats in all this IIT. Now, if you are anyways, you are going to select only one, right? What 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 IITs will do? Each and every uh, IIT, they will give, uh, they will say that what are all the 
uh, uh, MTech uh, uh, seeds which is going to be applicable for you. Okay, so they will state that for COP. They will give it to COP. Now in COP portal, in Common Offer Acceptance portal, they will be displaying you. For example, you got MTech in Thermal in IIT Madras, two uh, MTech in Design in IIT Bombay. 3 m tech in uh, production uh, production technology in iit karpur etc so they will be giving you all these things and out of this you need to select one okay and for selecting that there are three different options the first option is accept and freeze this is something for example in the first round okay in the first round they given five offers for you and out of that five offers you like one offer okay you decided that i will go for it for example let us consider you are going for m tech in thermal Okay, so what you will do, I will just click on that M tech in uh, thermal, then I will select the option accept and freeze. Okay, accept and freeze means you are accepting that offer, you are freezing that offer, you are not willing to go for second round. Okay, you are not willing to go for second round, you already decided that I am going to join M tech in IIT uh, Madras, that's it. Okay, so you will accept it, you will freeze it, then for the second round, you won't, uh, the, the, your, your application won't be considered. Okay, already your, your offer will be locked. Okay, and the main main important point which they are highlighting is after accept and freeze, you need to press the submit button. Okay, right now, again you are having five offers, but all the five offers are not satisfactory. But one offer is partially satisfa satisfactory. For example, you are getting IIT Madras, but you are not getting core department. You are getting some interdisciplinary department. Let us imagine in one. In all the other, in all the other four, you are not getting the offers which you desired to. So what you will, what I will do, I will choose this. Okay, I will choose the option IIT Madras, uh, interdisciplinary department. So I will keep it as the last option. So what I will do, I will retain it. Retaining means I will click it, I will choose it, but I will be waiting. So waiting means I, I will proceed for second round. So this offer will be there in my hand. Okay, the first offer will be there in the in my hand. For example, interdisciplinary department in iit madras okay it will be there in my hand by keeping that uh, offer in my hand i will proceed to second round now in the second round i will get variety of offers right so out of that offers i can choose i can choose anyone if i like if i like anyone i can choose it okay again if in the fifth uh, sorry in the second round also you are not liking any offer means what you will do again there are two possibilities you need to retain and wait that is, you will retain this same offer which you already have. That is interdisciplinary department, IIT Madras. So you will retain it and you will wait for third. will wait for third round, right? And fine. Uh, what we will, we will consider something like this. In the second round, they given five offers. But all the five offers are not satisfied for you. So what you will give? Again, you will give retain and wait. Okay. So now during the third round also, you will have that interdisciplinary IIT Madras. And then you will have some other uh some other four or five offers whatever it is now again in the third round also you are not satisfied what you will do you cannot give retain and wait retain and wait again which means same department i read the word somewhere same institute same program you can give retain and wait only for two times so in the first round you given retain and wait for interdisciplinary department iit madras the second round again you given retain and wait for interdisciplinary department IIT Madras. So for the third round, you cannot give for this. You can give for any other. Okay, remaining four are there, right? For that four, out of that four, you can give for anything. But for this, you cannot give. You cannot give. Only two, only two times is possible. Okay. But anyways, if you like any offer in the second round itself, okay, if you like offer any offers in the second round itself, you will accept and freeze it. No issues at all. Similarly, if you like any offers in third round itself, you, you will accept and freeze. No issues at all. But if you don't like any offers, then if you want to proceed for the fourth round, you cannot give return and wait for this. Okay, you have to give any other, uh, you have to choose any other one. Okay, I hope it is uh, clear for you. Uh, right, so other, that's what I'm saying. So the remaining, out of the remaining, you can choose anything. Only the one which you already did, okay, which you already given two times, right? Uh, two times return and wait. That you should not choose. Now, the option three is reject and wait. Okay, for example, first round, you are getting five offers. Okay, you didn't like all the five offers. Nothing, you, you are not at all satisfied. So directly you will reject all the offers, you will go for, uh, you will wait. And now all these five offers won't come back for you. Okay, you rejected it. So there is no possibility for these five offers to come back to, come back to you. 
okay so in the subsequent round uh, they they mentioned it somewhere you can you can just go through it but anyways whatever the point needed i just said to you okay so out of the five if you are rejecting it you cannot accept it again okay okay so these are the basic three things which you are going to do and in the last round okay in the last round there are there will be some uh, four or five main rounds and there is possibility for some two additional rounds okay so totally there is possibility for six to seven rounds okay in the last round there will be only two options one is accept and freeze if you are accepting freezing you are accepting the offer and then you are going to get admission in that particular college which you wish to if you are rejecting that's it okay so you are just rejecting it and you are proceeding you are just uh, leaving all the offers okay now um registration process it is very simple you just need to i will just go through that in the these are some tentative dates which they given okay so tentative dates when the rounds are going to happen all those things okay and then similarly um, additional rounds tentative day, uh, date here they given four rounds there is a possibility for minimum two rounds okay minimum two rounds okay now coming to flow charts okay so i will just go through the flow charts um so that uh, it will be complete okay right now you could see here the registration process is very simple I, i already said that you need to apply individual iit separately then you just accept the terms you just read the procedure and instruction and accept the terms of uh, cope and you have to give the desired uh, like all your information gate registration number whatever the registration number which you are using for example gate 2021 score cards number okay registration number um yeah so all these things you know i hope that you can do it and so submit it and log in via uh, email and sms and that's it you have to just verify it and if you have any additional score for example if you have 2019 score 2020 score you need to update that also okay you need to update that also and then finally you submit it and on the date they mentioned okay on the date they mentioned like here you could see here on the date they mentioned uh, you can just go to the cop portal and you can check okay now offer uh, uh, flow chart as i already said that in the first offer for example you are getting five different seats if you like it you will accept and freeze okay so if you accept and freeze it if you submit it you will go to the uh, institute which you are offered for example iit madras mtech you will go to the website and you will complete the remaining procedures there will be some procedures for example they will ask you to pay some fee and they will ask you to do some procedure you will complete the procedure then you will be getting the seat okay if you are not satisfied with accept you are not satisfied with that you will uh, go for retain and wait okay you will be retaining something and you will be waiting and then uh, again you will be visiting for co for the next round so same continuous same proceed okay and now fourth round suppose uh, uh, there are two possibilities as i said one is you need to accept and freeze or else you need to choose you you know offer will be choose okay so either you need to choose it or you are not choosing it if you are not choosing it it is retain and wait and then you just visit co for the next round and again as usual it continues okay the last course uh, in law, before that i need just just need to say this there are three possibility right either you will choose the preferred order offer or you you won't choose anything or you will forget it okay if you forget it then what will happen automatically they will give reject and wait okay automatically they will give reject and wait and then you need to visit for the next okay so if you forget checking the portal then automatically uh, you will get reject and wait and then you need uh, they, uh, it, it will be proceeded to next round okay same thing happens for the last round also and uh, anyways you will be receiving a mail okay but it is better to check the co portal regularly uh, on the date they mentioned okay and now similarly these flow chart also it's almost similar i'm not going to go through this i hope it will be enough okay so i think that's it that is what majorly it is involved if you have any other questions also it is there in the browser i just gone through this browser just to make sure that uh, you are just to make one important conclusion that is this one okay this point i feel that you want a uh, few of you will think that cope is a portal where you need to apply it's not like that cope is just for accepting the offer and for this also okay only two times you can give return and wait only two times you can give return and wait for a, a same uh, offer in the same institute so when you are doing that be very wise when you are selecting the option okay so just think properly and uh, decide whether you need to return and wait or you need to accept or you need to what you need to do 
okay so during these uh, steps that is return and wait accept and freeze reject and wait you have to be very very careful okay 